All right, so this is about tapping the end of 80-20. So I'm using, now these are the bits I recommend, uh, the DeWalt uh, Impact Ready bits. I'm actually using the quarter 20, which isn't uh, in the package, it's in the end of the drill. So I'm, I'm going for a drill that's not powerful, so if you have different options, definitely go for something that's not powerful. Um, I have this set on regular drill, not hammer. I have this set on one, and I have this set as weak as possible, so it, the clutch will disengage if it catches or binds. All right, so a couple things to make this real simple is I'm gonna squirt a little bit of oil. So I got my oil squirter right here. I'm gonna put a little dab in there and a little, whoop, I, meant, I didn't get that on video, and a little dab in there. So I got my two little drips of oil that I've put in, and now I'm going to run the drill. So let me get set up. Make sure you clamp it down before you start. I'm just using this cheap Harbor Freight clamp so that way it just won't move on me. This is no big deal. You just don't want it to be sliding around or you don't want to be trying to fight it and hold it with your other hand. You want both of your hands available to sustain the drill. Let's get started. All right, so here we go. Let's, so now watch. So I'm gonna, my threads are clean. I've been cleaning them off with just, you know, a plastic bristle brush after every, every tap. So nice and slow, I'm only pulling the trigger about a quarter inch and I'm just gonna, if I feel any kickback, I'm gonna let go and I'm gonna reverse. Nice and slow. All right, so it's starting to bind a little bit, but it's not really catching. And that, it started to catch there at the very end, so I'm gonna back it up. I'm gonna put it in and I'm done. And now I'm backing it out. Now I do, you can go faster back, backing it up. But there you go. It is that simple. So now what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna, over my garbage can down below, I'm just going to use my plastic bristle brush. I'm gonna run it. I'm gonna try to get all the shavings off real quick so they don't bind up for the next hole. And just like that, let's hit the next hole. Nice and slow, quarter pullish. So it's just slowly pulling forward. The drill's doing all the work. I'm kind of just monitoring for it to not catch. I don't want to snap the bit inside. The bit is hardened steel. Uh, it's getting a little tight, so I'm gonna back it up. Okay, and now I'm gonna go in again. It's a little tighter, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna this one will have to work its way in a little bit. And there we go, we're all the way in. I'm gonna back it up, pull it out. So I really think the combination of everything here, the oil, the the DeWalt, the amazing DeWalt drill bits here, I really think these, these are a really fantastic tap set. It starts binding up on you a little bit more and it's not really progressing at the rate that I've just shown. Then back it out a bit and wipe it off real quick with your with your plastic bristle brush a little bit just to knock off a bunch of the shavings and then work it in and out again and all, and then it'll go in now i've already done this i just wanted to show you that because that's what i that's what i just had to do for this particular one